Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Tiana here. Uh, today I have got a little bit of a different video for you. I am starting a 12 week fitness challenge and I uh, will be doing weekly updates. So if you'd like to um, see what that's all about, stay tuned. fitness program it is 12 weeks and it's the 12 weeks from um, today Monday until the Monday before Christmas um, I'm very nervous and excited I've never done a collab before and I have never I don't really do fitness on my channel I don't really talk about my weight um, so it is very different uh, so please guys be supportive or just keep scrolling by um, so I a uh, YouTuber that I watch, uh, Lexi, from Lexi Down Under, she's awesome, she's an American uh, living here in Oz, or in Melbourne, and um, she's so motivating, so inspiring, so positive, and just honest, like, she'll just be like, guys, I had a crap day today, um, and I love that, I think that's really important to be, like, yeah, totally just real. My weight has sort of always fluctuated as an adult, um, I find it very difficult to lose weight, uh, I do have polycystic ovarian syndrome, um, which uh, makes it a little bit more difficult for me. And when I diet, I tend to use a like a low GI diet because it works best for my body. My pro body does process sugars um, differently um, to like an everyday person. Um, I am currently at my heaviest weight. I will get into it and believe it or not, tell you how much I weigh, which. I don't want to do but I'm going to do because it's going to push me to do better um, so about a month ago I went to my doctor and because I me and James would like to get pregnant again uh, which is exciting but I knew that my weight was an issue and was going to be an issue for my doctor so I just went to him yeah we had an appointment and it didn't go great he got me to go on the scales and I saw the biggest number I have ever seen so far for myself um, and I just sort of broke down. I really did not handle it well um, and I sort of came back and was really negative and uh, which is not me. I'm usually a really positive person but it just really hit home how serious it was um, and how much heavier I was even than the day I gave birth to Noah. So in regards to fitness, it's there's no rules, there's no diet, there's no program. It's just a bunch of YouTubers all doing weekly updates um, using the hashtag fitness2017. Um, I will have all the other participants, all the other YouTubers that are doing fitness linked down below. Um, so please check them out, show them some love and support. And it's just really great to get a group of people together who can motivate each other. So, um, although there's no set rules, I have kind of made some rules for myself. Um, not too many because I don't, I'm not a rule follower. Um, so I didn't want to make it too difficult for myself, but I do have a goal and I do have some rules. So, um, let's start with my rules. So my number one treat or bad thing, I know it's the worst thing, I know it's the um, the main reason that my weight is so bad and it is diet coke I am obsessed with diet coke I love it I drink it all the time I drink way too much of it um, and it's such a bad habit and I find it very difficult to break I have tried other soft drinks mineral water soda water it's all terrible diet coke is where it is at um, so my number one rule is no diet coke I'm going cold turkey and yeah, it's going to be very hard. It's going to be the hardest thing for me. Um, second thing is exercise. I don't do a lot or I haven't currently been doing a lot. The past month since my doctor's appointment, I've been making a little bit of an effort to really try and incorporate into some, some exercise into my daily routine. Um, so I usually um, put on YouTube and watch other fitness people, um, fitness YouTubers doing videos or um, some with kids and some not. My favourite so far is Fit Mummy. I will have her link down below even though she's not a part of this group but she's very inspiring and I've been doing her workouts um, consistently and I do them with Noah. He thinks it's fun. I don't get like a full on solid uninterrupted workout. That's just not going to happen. Um, I'm a mum of a toddler so that's not going to work. Um, but I do get pumping. My heart rate gets up. 
I'm doing something. So it's really fun. Noah thinks it's hilarious. He will ride me as a horse while I'm planking, but um, it's something. So that is, I'm going to be doing that. I'm also um, committing to waking up one hour earlier at 6 a.m. and going for a run every day of the Monday to Friday. I'll see how I go on weekends, but I do like a sleep in. Um, and that's mainly just because it's my only guaranteed time without Noah. I have to do it while he's either asleep or awake. Um, but I will be waking up one hour earlier, going for a run, and then trying to incorporate it work out with him during the day. Obviously, I'm going to watch what I'm eating. We eat pretty healthy in regards to like meals. It's mainly my soft drink and treats, snacks, you know, chips and stuff like that. Um, so cutting out late night snacking as well, um, just watching the portions, um, making sure there's heaps of veggies and just really good snacks. I'm going to swap my breakfast routine. As for my goal, I've put a pretty ambitious goal on the 12 week challenge, um, but I feel like if I only put a small goal, if I reach it, I'm going to be really unmotivated, I think, to keep going. Um, so I'd like to lose 12 kilos in 12 weeks, um, which is, I think it's reachable, but it's going to be really hard work for me. I, I work three to, yeah, three shifts a week at night, I have no full time, so I don't have a lot of time for myself, but I'm making an effort to make time for me and make time to prep some snacks to make it easier for me. But I think with just a little bit of exercise, cane out the snacks and Diet Coke, I'm going to do great. I'm going to smash my goal, guys. Um, but I'm going to be happy with anything. I just want to say that now. If I don't reach my goal, I'm not going to be... Although I might be disappointed, I'm not going to get down on myself. If I lose 2 kilos, I'm going to be stoked. If I lose 5, I'm going to be stoked. But my goal is 12 kilos in 12 weeks by Christmas. Every Monday, I'll have an update on my weight um, and the fitness challenge and what I'm doing and how it's going. So stay tuned every Monday if you are interested in... Um, helping me along my weight loss journey um, so now the hardest part is my weight uh, I don't really want to tell people and I tossed up whether I would um, state my weight or not but I really think it's gonna make me accountable for my weight and it's gonna push me to do better and it's just honest so um, uh, no one but my husband knows and now the world is gonna know but I am at my heaviest I've ever ever been. Um, when I was the day I gave birth to Noah, I was 99 kilos. So I've actually cracked the hundred mark, and it's devastating. I am not happy about it. I will show you a clip um, at the very end of me on the scales and my body in workout clothes. Um, but I will tell you, I'm about 110, just yeah, 110, one and a, 110 and a half um, kilos. Um, don't know what that is in pounds guys I'm sorry um, it's not good in pounds that's for sure so um, that is my starting weight okay guys fitness 2017 here we go please be nice okay so here is my pre body workout um, as you can see everywhere is kind of big <laughs> so this is a free body shot Okay, now for the scales. Ah! All right, that's it there. One eleven. That's it for my first fitness video, guys. Um, I hope you can all uh, be supportive and helpful, as it's going to be very difficult for me. Um, and I hope, I wish everyone else doing fitness the best. I know you're going to smash it, guys. Um, there's a lot of people, a lot of people that aren't so fit and a lot of people that are fit. But, um, yeah, I'm wishing everyone the best. I hope you all do a fantastic job. We can do it, guys. Okay, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.